you see, people hear the knowledge, but they don't go deeper into it. You see, the, just like uh, you see, for, um, for for example, nowadays spirituality is a trend. Go to America, everybody is following a certain trend. You know? When you want to give them the deepness of spirituality itself, you know, they don't want that. It's just like the coating sugar. You know? Everybody have to do yoga. You know, everybody have to dress in a certain way. You know, I'm very spiritual. But that don't lead anywhere. This is the problem. They hear all this, yes, but for a very short time, they will go and manifest on the road just for one day. But that don't change anything in them. You know, if it's, uh, true spirituality is what have touched you and transformed you. And that you can see, it's very few. That's why Bhagavan Krishna said, many are called, but only few really come to that point of realization. And even that few, only one will get to know who I am. Because it is so rare. Yes. That rarity of, of really go deeper and deeper, no matter what, into that spiritual path. It's quite rare. <laughs> I'm still looking for somebody, me. <laughs> so, really, it's easy to say, you know, yes, you know, there's so knowledge or whatever. But knowledge doesn't mean what you're hearing only. Hearing without assimilating it will not change anything. It's like you're listening now, beautiful words, yes or no? Sounds beautiful, I guess. So. Tomorrow you will go out, you'll say, what did he say? I didn't understand anything. Is that what will happen? Well, some of you may appear you're listening, but in reality you're sleeping. You're thinking, what, when will I eat? My stomach is paining. Huh? So it is not only what you say. You say like a professor outside may teach a certain subject, but it have nothing in affinity to that subject. And you know, when he go back home, he's back to his old self. Like that, you see, many will teach this knowledge on the outside, but they don't go deeper into really of living that. But those who live that knowledge, they have that clear understanding and they're clear with themselves but yet I know what is my path that is the knowledge of discrimination uh, when you have that knowledge of discrimination then you will know what it is right and what is wrong without any judgment that is discernation also Because it is easy to say how you say, you know, because the ground are very shallow. Now, when the ground are shallow, it's easy. There's no, I say, you can walk very easily, nicely, but when it starts to get deeper and deeper, you don't want to adventure. <laughs> like that, there's many people like this. Because deeper it goes, more you will have to face yourself. More you have to face yourself, more you have to see also part of you who you didn't want to see. That's why many people don't adventure into that. <laughs> Spirituality is very beautiful, but it can be also very dangerous if you're not ready. That's why I always say, in the path of love, you have to become, a, the, path, the spiritual path, you have to become a, a gambler. The difference between a gambler and a businessman, a businessman would do his business. If it works, it works. If it doesn't work, it will go look somewhere else. But a gambler will persist. 